Yo, what's up everyone? It's your boy Real Will here. Listen, I hope your Sunday was awesome in Ohio. It's raining a lot, but it's good because we have not seen rain in a month. Was it that? Yeah, yeah. I've been carrying mail for about three months, no, two months, and I think we had like one rainy day, if that. So these past couple days during the hurricane, um, down south, it's been crazy up here. It's been nuts in uh, Columbus, Ohio, but it's good because when rain comes, blessings pour down. You feel what I'm saying? So, but this video is a support and resistance type of video. Um, I want to get into how I trade. Um, there is no right or wrong way to trade if you can make profits. If you can make profit, if you can show that you can pass prop firms or, you know, turn your money into more profits as far as compounding it, you know, strategies work. ICT work, support and resistance work, set and forget work, Fibonacci's work, supply and demand works. Um, every strategy works, guys. I was funded. I'm still funded. Um, I recently just lost my top stat because I was I was trying to do the strat, and I just felt like price action is cool. I love price action, but when they hit a support zone or a, a resistance zone, I just want to buy. I don't want to wait for a candle to you know close above this candle for a two two reverse all that not all that which is cool which is good. I got funded three times using that, but I never got payouts. Um, all my payouts from the futures market came from support and resistance, which I had one payout. Uh, it was like 1800 I believe. No, 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 800 800 because they had to do half, and I lost it. So, but anyways, um, I want to show y'all a little bit of my support and resistance, but before we get there, I want to show y'all my... This is Apex. I am funded with them. I have not paid my activation fee because um, I didn't want to blow it. Um, fear, yes, is playing a big part of it, but it is a static. So I want to make sure my discipline is on point. Um, I want to grow this slowly using micros, maybe one or two micros, you know, you know, do stuff like that. This is my 50K account that I am growing right now, again. <laughs> man, I wish it would show how many times I was funded with them, man. Let me see. Gosh. These are all ineligible. Man, I, I wasted a lot of money, you know, trying to pass this stuff. This is just half of it. But anyways, I was funded a few times. But anyways, that's not the point. So I traded on Friday. I made really it was eight hundred and seventy four dollars, but I ended up trying to you know get get a little bit more um, profits, and you know I ended up with seven hundred twenty nine dollars, which is fine. I'm fine with that. You know, it is what it is. Um, so it is what it is. But one thing I'm I'm realizing is when you get that one. So say you take three trades in a day. Once you win that first trade. Just go. Just go home. Close the laptop. Turn off your phone. Just end the day because there's a good chance that the reason why you're not profitable is because you keep giving back these profits. If that's you, put a uh, one in the comment section. You know, like it. <laughs> that's you because that's me. Um, and I do that a whole lot. So let's get straight to the charts, guys. I just want to show you a simple strategy that you can use. Um, yeah, so this is September 24th. We're going to replay this. I'm going to do a random. I don't know where we're going to go. We got to find, find it. Random bar. All right. Let's see where you are. We got to find it now. Where are you? But one thing I know for sure, um, experience is key. I have been listening to Nick Sean. Where are you? What, what the freak? I've been listening to Nick Sean. There we go. On YouTube. And, man, experience is key. Like, I told my wife, I said, 
right now, if you look at this market, just randomly, would you buy it or would you sell it? And she said, I will buy. Let's buy. She don't know nothing about trading. And she ended up winning. <laughs> so experience, I would tell new. This is what I would tell myself. And this is how I'm going to teach my son. Don't focus on the strategy right now if you're new. If you don't have no strategy, don't focus. Focus on building experience. Focus on what you believe and feel in your gut, your intuition. What is your gut feeling telling you? So you buy, buy. So it's like flipping a coin, you know? So, for example, I don't know where we are. Where we at? Friday. All right, let's go to Sunday. We're on the daily. Let's go off the daily, though. Um, let's let's go to the let's go to the hour. But we gotta find it, freak. But experience is the key. Where are you, bruh? Bruh, gosh, bruh. All right, I see the four hour. We go to the four hour. Forget it. I don't know what what's going on. What's going on? But experience is the key, guys. And when you feel in your gut to get out of a trade, enter a trade, or whatnot, let's see if we can win money without no strategy. Because I was gonna teach y'all to support resistance, but this video right now is called experience. <laughs> let's gain experience. And based off of my experience, I am going to enter these trades. I'm not going to put a support resistance line. I'm not going to do any of that. I'm just going to whatever I feel. No stop loss, nothing. If I want to add, I add. So right here, uh, I want to mm, I want to say I want to I want to I want to buy. All right, we up. Do I add or do I take my profit? What, what, what would y'all do right now? Would y'all take your profit or would you add? Let me make sure I'm on the right so y'all can Oh, y'all can't see me. Freak. Ah, my bad, guys. Dang it. All right. That sucks. Based off experience, are y'all taking your money or are you going to add on to it? Or you going to let it run? What do you feel? How I feel. I'm going to let it run. Um, Let's add. I'm just randomly doing stuff, guys. No strategy to it. No strategy to it. What are we going to do? We're going to take our money? No strategy to it. Just straight experience. I'm going to take it. Boom. All right. So what are we doing? Are we going to buy or are we selling? Based off of your experience, what you've been seeing in the market. You going to sell or buy? I am going to... I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to buy. I'm taking it. This is just me saying buy or sell. Which one? This is why experience is so important in trading. And, and I believe this is one reason why I was losing these prop firms, guys. I can get funded. I don't know a lot of traders who get funded like me. Like I'm talking, but the bad thing is I lose most of my funding because I try to over leverage and try to get these payouts quickly. So experience is the key and i'm going back to using my gut feeling and support resistance but right now we just using what you feel do you feel sell do you feel buy right here what do y'all feel should we sell should we sell i'm gonna sell stop loss i i don't know there's no stop loss but we won't go past a thousand dollars it's key all right this is es as well so it's like twelve dollars and fifty cents per tick so we won't lose if we hit thousand dollars we had get out the trade all right let's do it i'm selling what are we doing we're gonna add on or we're gonna keep selling what you want to do add on let's add on 
Ooh. Ooh, all right, let's get out. All right, so we, we up $25. We took L, whatever. All right, let's sell. I feel like it's going to sell. I don't know. Let's do it. Experience. We're going to add? Let's add. All right, are we going to stay in or are we going to add? Let's add. Are we taking our money or are we going to stay in? What y'all want to do? Let's add another one. Let's take the money. We up 2100 right now. This is what I'm saying. This is... This is experience. This is no strategy I'm using. I'm not, I'm not using no strategy right now, guys. None at all. What y'all want to do? Y'all want to sell or you want to wait? Want to sell or wait? What y'all want to do? Let's sell. All right, let's do it. Ooh. Boom. We take a $1,000 loss. Right now, we still up $1,000. Based off of sale. Based off of experience, my bad. And yeah, it don't make no sense, but this is for the new traders. This is for new traders. And I recommend that you do this on a demo account, not your real money. <laughs> don't do this with your real money. Do not do this with your real money. Do this on a demo account only, guys. Um, so let's see what we're going to do. Let's sell. Uh, let's buy another one. What are we doing? We taking our money? All right, we're going to take it. 1800 We done? So what I'm doing is just gaining experience, and I wish traders would actually teach this more, you know? I wish traders would actually teach gaining experience more. I think that is the key so they can know how the market move and they get that feeling like, hey, get out the trade a little early. Cut your losses. Hey, you up $200. Take that $200 and walk away. I think experience is the key, guys. And like I said, there's no strategy. This is just experience. And I think for new beginners, even me, myself, if you don't have experience, if all you had was just a strategy, um, and we are highly worshiping technical analysis, but we realizing like we ignoring our gut feeling. How many times you use a Fibonacci or supply and demand, and it said in your gut it was like, "Hey, I think you should cut it. I think you should get out. It's not going your way." But you said, "No, no, no. I'm gonna keep going. I'm gonna keep entering." And then you lose. You see what I'm saying? So make sure you like, share, and subscribe, guys. Um, maybe one day soon I can have my son or my wife get on this charts, and they will do it. Right now it's me doing it, and based on my experience, I know a little bit how to market. Like, I saw support resistance. I saw certain things. I literally would have never lost that $1,000 because I would have, feeling I would have been like, nah. It hit his resistance. Let me get out. But this was not a video about strategy. It's a video about experience. So make sure you don't be in my comments talking about that is a bad way to do it. You gambling? No. No. Listen, I didn't get funded six, seven, eight times, ten times. <laughs> you know, and got shoot. Let me see. I was funded probably ten times and had like five payouts total. So. That's not bad, 50-50, but it wasn't profitable enough because I kept switching strategies, strategy hopping. But now I am secure who I am. I have my job um, that's helping me to not focus as much on trading um, So to pay my bills. So, yeah, man, hopefully you like, hopefully you like this video. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe. Let's get it.